when Mike Foster introduced himself to the people of Louisiana as a candidate for governor. Workforce development was on his mind. Today, because of his vision for Louisiana's community and technical colleges, his legacy lives on, on our campuses, with our faculty and staff, with our students, and with the businesses and industries we serve. I could not begin to list everything positive that Governor Foster did or everything that was done under his administration or because of his leadership. I've always said that I think Governor Foster is going to be remembered as a truly great governor for Louisiana because of the advances that were made in education at the time, particularly the commitment to higher education and the creation of this new system. Well, governor Foster was a fixer. I mean, in every part of his life, he would fix things. He'd fix machines. And when he came to government, he wanted to fix things that were broken. And in Louisiana, back in the 90s, we were already 30 years behind the rest of the country in creating a community college system. And so obviously that was what he wanted to fix. You know, for Mike, the preparation of workforce, getting people ready to perform for businesses, and giving an individual who may, he may be coming right out of high school, he or she, she may be doing it after having had a child in her mid-20s or even 30s or later could be a mid-career change. He believed that education was the key to opportunity and it was the key to success in life. And for Mike, you couldn't begin to have that in our state without a strong community and technical college system that had the right strategies and the right funding. I think that Governor Foster was uh, the most transformative uh, governor in my lifetime in terms of uh, making massive changes in terms of uh, first of all, the community technical college system uh, had lasting impact, but he funded higher education in ways that nobody prior to him had funded it. Uh, he created uh, the accountability system for our K-12 uh, education system. He passed a major tax reform in the form of the Stelly Bill. Uh, he made some important improvements in our civil law system. Uh, he brought fiscal discipline uh, to, the to, to the state budget and capital outlay program. Uh, and so every year, uh, he and his staff uh, developed a package of fixes to problems that needed to be addressed. And it was clear from day one that he had a, a lot of things he wanted to accomplish, uh, but workforce training, and I think that's coming from his background and his business, were extremely important to him. I think Mike Foster came around with a time to where he brought a common sense approach to politics. I mean, Mike was a businessman. He was also had the experience of his family being in politics. He had a governor who, I mean, a grandfather, I believe, or a great-grandfather who was a governor. So they kind of grew up in the, in the system, and he brought a common sense approach to it. The thing that Mike did was that he let everybody know what he really believed in, and he was just incredibly, incredibly honest, almost bluntly honest at, at times, and people liked the fact that there was nothing fake. It was all real and it was all about doing real things. You ask most people what they remember about those eight years, and you know, they think about things like bringing state debt down by billions, think about the balanced budgets every year, they think about investing in teacher pay, bringing uh, teachers to the Southern Regional Average, which is a really important thing for him. Investing in universities every year and making sure that every community technical college and university was spared every budget cut for eight years. A lot of students that are getting training now, getting a start in their education, uh, that never had that opportunity before. Higher education was fully funded through the formula for the first time ever under uh, Mike Foster's leadership, and I think that's going to be a real lasting legacy that, that he will have. That was almost the essence of Mike Foster. You take something and you twist from what you thought it was going to be, and he puts this incredibly earthy, real, every man's viewpoint on it, and it just it kind of changed the way you thought about it. And that, that, was, that was very, very uh, much like Mike. Everything about him was common sense. Side of him where he could laugh at himself, he could laugh at issues, he could work through issues. I mean, the guy was really good, and I gotta tell you, the state of Louisiana and the people in it really, really came out ahead by having Mike Foster the governor for those eight years. I mean, he did a great job. You couldn't ask for any more uh, dedication from an individual at time that he put in. So, Mike, thank you so much for your service, and thanks for everything you did.